All right, welcome back to your Algebra 1 review packet, uh, exam review packet. In this video, we're going to take a look at part 18. Find the slope of each line, this time from an equation. This is probably the easiest thing ever, okay? Uh, when your equation is in slope-intercept form, and all these equations are, uh, and the slope-intercept form means that the y is isolated. It's in this form y equals mx plus b, where the b, in this case a 4, is your y-intercept. And this number right here, the coefficient of x, is the slope, which is 6 fifths. So you're just copying down whatever the coefficient of x is as your slope. Super easy. Um, for example, down here, the coefficient of x is negative 3. So slope is negative 3. Two things you have to watch out for. Up here, if you just have an equation that's y equals, this is like y equals 0x plus 2. They just won't put in the 0x because it's 0. So the slope here is 0. The other thing you have to watch out for is down here. You just have x equals something and there's no y. This is undefined. Because a line like this is... A vertical line that passes through the x-axis at x equals negative 2. And vertical lines have our undefined slope, no slope at all. Okay? So again, if it's just y equals, then it's zero slope. The slope is zero, which means it's a horizontal line, by the way. It doesn't rise or fall. It's not steep at all. And here, undefined is when you just have x equals something and there's no y because that's a vertical line. Other than that, the slope is always going to be the coefficient of x. Pretty straightforward. Make sure you check your answers. There's not a whole lot of work to show. Good luck.